Good morning, 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 y'all. It's time to get some money. We don't need to talk no more. We, hey, we got a pickup order I got to get right now for $18.56, a three drop off order for 4.7. Why are we still here for it? Catch you when we drop this stuff off. Drama already, y'all. First order. The address that they put in, they can't find it on the Google Maps. <laughs> Here we go. Already? Come on now. I'm just trying to make some money. That's it. That's it. Can y'all put the right address in so I could deliver your orders? No! Please. Y'all, so now the address wants to pop, pop up on Google. But now they got me walking. <laughs> I got 53 minutes to walk. I guess you can't tell if I'm driving. Does this happen to you on Walmart Spark? Like, come on, get it together. Y'all, it's early in the morning. Y'all had time to do whatever with this app or whatever. <sighs> I hope this is the only hiccup we have today, y'all. Because if it's going to be like this all day, yeah, I will call it quits because... I would turn on a whole nother app like this thing even upside down. I'm not that way turning around. <laughs> like, come on, man. But we got 46 more minutes to walk towards this destination. So um I catch y'all in about an hour. Alright, Hustle Game, we got that first one dropped off. They wanted me to put it in the house, so I put it in the house, you know. We gotta help people that are lazy now these days. They pay for the service and stuff, but don't want to pay for the tips for doing this. Cause you know, we only supposed to be delivering this to these people's doorstep. And um, now, you know, a lot of them want us to put them in their house. Next is going, they gonna want us to put it up. Next is gonna be, they want us to cook their food and stuff. Really? Um, like, this is getting ridiculous. Like they want so much of us to where they don't even care about tipping us, they don't. Just because they feel they pay their little fee on for Walmart, that don't got nothing to do with us. They don't. We might get a park. Oh, this person right here can't drive. Uh, boy, this is not the great morning for Wednesday, y'all. It is not. We got to get back to some good vibes, y'all. Bad, bad, bad. Bad, 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 bad. The app acting crazy got me walking and GPS won't pick up stuff. People want me to go in their house. House smell like a pack of fucking, not even a pack, it smell like a factory of food parts. Stop it. GPS want to work here and there. People want us to uh, go grocery shopping for them, put the stuff up and cook the food now. Like, come on, man, this is getting ridiculous. And they only want to tip us a dollar to do all this stuff. Burn our gas, wear and tear on our car when they can just Go to the store themselves and do all this themselves and save them a whole lot of money. But let's go try to hopefully find out where the next drop off at. Yeah. Second one dropped off. GoPro got full, y'all. Hopefully this is it. This is it. I'm going to say a little prayer. And then we're going to get our day going to making money. Hopefully this is it, y'all. Woosa. Woosa. One, two, three. All right, you guys, we got a nice, nice, nice order right now. We got an order for $25. Hold on, excuse me. $25.16. It's a three stop order for 5.4 mile. Let go. Eight, eight, eight. Now, that was a great customer. I did exactly what they uh, told me to do in, um, in the comments. And by me doing that, it earned me an extra $5. And now this order is now worth $30 for 5.5 miles. Lego. All right, Hustle Game, we got the last one dropped off. It was another person that uh, needed it to be brought inside. Um, I didn't mind it. It was a few items, and they all did tip good on the app, plus the additional $5, so I don't mind making $30 an hour. So, 
it wasn't no problem with that. The only problem I hate is when people don't tip or barely tip and expect us to do everything for them. But now that that's over, now we gotta make our way to Bonefish Grill. Yes, you heard right. We're going to Bonefish Grill for a eight or nine hundred dollar order. So catch y'all when we get there. All right, y'all. We at Bonefish Grill for nine hundred and forty-four dollars and fifty. 50 cents for 6.6 miles. It should take only about 12 minutes. A delivery commission of $18.59 and a delivery pool of $21 and $27. Lego. All right, Hustle Game. Here we are again. But um, it was a problem with that last order. Uh, Bonefish Grill. Uh, Employees forgot a order. They forgot the uh, shrimp. Oh. And I'm, cause I'm thinking to myself, dang, they all just eating salad today. <laughs> normally they, they normally have meat and salad and dessert. So um, they easy case ended up calling the guy who ordered the food and told him they left it. Well, they forgot something. So he was trying to see if I could go back, but I'm like, ah, I can't. I got another one left. So I asked Easy Kate, I said, will it, you know, conflict, whatever. But the man, he, you know, thought he saying, you know what, you know, you got a job to do. So I go pick it up. So he's going to pick that up while I'm heading my way to the next catering order. But I wonder how does that work when the employee, the wherever you get your food from, if they leave something, do they just take it off your order or they send another driver out to bring it to you? Or how does that work? Because knowing something like that was to happen even though that's not my fault at all um i wonder would they you know tamper with the tip because if they did it still wouldn't affect us because we get a tip for them. so just curious about that have y'all had any of that happen you go to get an order and if people tell you that's everything and it's really not and by the time you deliver it or whatever you know you end up they get the call or maybe you get a call about something missing that's why they should kind of give us a list of what we should be picking up because that makes it you know hard on us. All we get to know is the total price of the food. So maybe um, Easy Cater deliver that. Maybe I should invest into part of letting us know what we're picking up so we can make sure that that doesn't happen to a customer. Cause you know, that can really make somebody mad, especially if they got a meat or something and they miss, they missing the main dish. But um, let's go make our way to this next catering order. I think I believe it's Dunkin' Donuts. So, this will be an easy one. So, let me make my way. All right, guys, we arrived to Dunkin' Donuts for $74.97 of the order cost, 8.5 mile estimate distance time, 14 minutes, $7 in delivery commission, and $21 to $27 for tip pool. Now, let's go get this food. set that order up so it was easy to drop off you know like DoorDash and Ubi's you know a little simple for us but we make more money <laughs> than DoorDash and Ubi's because that order's gonna pay at least 30 something dollars but um it's lunch time um I might stick it out I'm gonna stick it out to, to one see if we can find something either on Ubi's or DoorDash or Walmart Spark and then we'll take a break and then we'll come up with the finals of what we have for the first half of our shift baby because we ain't staying out here all long no 8 and 10 12 hours we do shifts baby shifts that's the game we scored our last order before we took our break for walmart spark for 16 dollars we only going 2.3 miles but we only going shopping for seven items lego hustle game it's time for your boy to take a break and put some food in his belly walmart was trying to call your boy back they sent your boy an order for 22 dollars probably like six miles and they want to go shop for 18 i was like ah ah but i'm cool because part two i go get that money i'm gonna go get that after i take a break relax and eat watch some tv and then come back out 
But uh, we only did two apps today. We did Walmart Spark and Deliver That. As far as Walmart Spark, we did $34.13 and mm, trip earnings, unconfirmed daily tips of $26.07. Plus the five dollar bill we got, we got that extra five, y'all. And far as the catering order, we did two catering orders. One should be about, I always say thirty two, and the other one's gonna be a little bit higher because the delivery uh, commission was higher. It's like eighteen dollars, so that's probably like forty something dollars, totaling out to be one hundred and forty five dollars and seventy nine cents, y'all. And y'all think I'm joking? Look at this. It is one o five. So. If I really wanted to stay out and hit that big bag, it probably would be today. But I'm going to take an hour or two break and then come back out. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing and uh, keep hustling, my friends.